let's let's watch the director's cut shall we oh shit wait wait hold on i'm not ready okay hold on hey right, here we go to master your blade you must first control your emotions yeah i don't know if i can control it right now Ooh. yes that's the game it's in color now what director's cut PlayStation 5 features. Dynamic 4K resolution. Start I can't read that fast. Haptic feedback. Yes. Kicks. Adaptive. Yes. Of course. That's, that's me. Japanese lip sync. Oh my god. Whoa. Yeah. I have some comments about that actually. Which is cool. Yes, of course. Oh, I have not seen this. Oh shit. A whole new island. A new story. New and yeah. Oh, he. No blue tackle. August 20th. Horse antlers. Horse became. Okay. Woo! 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 No, no, no. No. Uh, yay. Wait, is there more? Is there more information? Wait, hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna go. What, Joe? I mean, I guess you all seen it already. Oh wait, no, that's not it. Oh my god. Okay, what what did we see just now? Okay, so oh Nobu has a has an armor. He looked badass. Scary too. Uh oh yeah, lip sync. I was talking so some of y'all was on Discord talking about the, the dubbing work that I'm doing. That's actual dubbing work not related to ghost um but the director for it was talking about how we can actually if we really wanted to in these uh tv shows even they can make a live actor's mouth match the the dub because you know what's that what's that the face thing what's that thing called what's that thing called deep fake fake deep fake which is scary and I, d I don't want that to be a thing but also it, I, I think they can do it so it's easy enough that uh you know to in a game where everything is um computer generated uh yeah they can do that with the uh, japanese lip sync and people wanted that so that's great I'm gonna do some research and um because I didn't do it before. I didn't do my homework, I suppose. Uh August 20th, uh goes to Switch My Rives. Where is the is there a do y'all know where to find a good info on my own game? PlayStation blog. I've been told that I should just focus on um uh, my sucker punch actually. <laughs> They're like, just stick to no, oh, not that. Yes, stay PlayStation blog. They told me to just focus on this, so I will focus on this. Uh, what has the year it's been as we all approach the one year anniversary? Yes, of course, we're so grateful. And it's kind of cool that they were, I didn't, so I, we don't know until the day before uh, when these things get announced. So I didn't know until yesterday that this was gonna be announced today. And it just so happens that I'm streaming the uh, the Ghost of Tsushima Appreciation Month uh, on July 1st. So thank you, Sucker Punch. I'm sure it was a coincidence, but thanks. Because uh, how apropos. Uh, it means so much to see how Jin's story has resonated with all of you. And we feel cr incredibly lucky to have such dedicated and supportive fans like y'all, Ghosts. 
We've thought a lot about how to expand Jin's story, and we've also spent the last year poring over all of your feedback. Nordskaya, <laughs> you have opinions. <laughs> a lot of you have, I mean, these are great opinions. Anyway, uh, feedback about how we could improve the experience of playing Ghost of Tsushima. We've been hard at work on a brand new edition of the game, which not only includes a new chapter in Jin's journey, but also some new updates that are a uh, direct response to some of the community's most requested features. Okay. They, you know, I mean, they've been doing that since the release. So, you know, they listen um, to your feedback. We're happy to announce that on August 20th, we'll be releasing Ghost of Tsushima Directors Go to on PS5 and PS4. And this series comes uh, packed not only with the original game and every piece of additional content we're sold today, but a brand new adventure for Jin alongside a bunch of new features that we're excited to reveal. Iggy Island. I'm just going to read all this just so I know what I can say and cannot say, which is to say I can only say what's what I'm about to read. <laughs> That's this. Is, I can't say anything beyond this. If you're a history buff, you may know that in addition to Tsushima, the neighboring island of Iki was also invaded during this time period. Today, we're excited to re reveal that a whole new chapter in Jin's journey is coming and will take place on Iki. In this new story, Jin travels to the island to investigate rumors of a Mongol presence, but soon he finds himself caught up in events with deeply personal stakes that will force him to relieve some traumatic moments from his past. Finds him as a caught up in the events with deeply personal stakes that will force him to relive some traumatic moments from his past. I'm sure some of y'all can guess what that is, but I am not going to confirm or deny anything. I'm not even going to read the chat right now. I'm just going to keep reading. We'll have more to share about the story of Iki soon, but today we can confirm that beyond a whole new story and new characters, this new island also features tons of new content, including brand new environments to explore, new armor for Jin as well as his horse, new minigames, new techniques, new enemy types, and much more. There are even new animals to fight. <coughs> I think I know what those animals are, but I don't want to... You know Did what? I don't, you know, don't want to know. Yes. I've seen a, <clears throat> a, a gif or a gif of uh, one of them. Yes, yeah, so I, that's been confirmed because I saw it. I didn't see the... I, I, I haven't... I didn't... I'm try, I was trying to avoid spoilers, but anyway. On bo both platforms, Director cut, uh, Director's Cut will also offer new trophies to unlock. I guess, because <laughs> I'm all about the trophies. Just collect, just numbers. While Director's Cut players on both PS4 and PS5 will be able to experience the Iki Island content places, five players will have access to a few additional new features. We've heard your feedback on the lack of Japanese lip sync in the original version of Ghost of Tsushima. It's something we worked hard to address in this new release. Oh, thanks to the PS5's ability to render cinematics in real time, cutscenes in Ghost of Tsushima and on Iki Island on PS5 will now offer lip sync for Japanese voice. Oh my god, so it's a PS5 thing. That's, uh, that's amazing. We're also happy to confirm that a Ghost of Tsushima, Ghost of Tsushima Legends, and the new Iki Island expansion will take all take advantage of haptic feedback and adaptive triggers in the director's cut. There will also be enhancements to 3D audio on PS5, as well as drastically improved load times. Improved? <laughs> Even more? Okay. 4K resolution options and frame rates targeting 60 FPS. Transferring your progress, if you already own Ghost of Tsushima on PS4, yes, yes. How, how does the money work? Even though I'm not going to pay for it. Psychopath is going to give it to me. No. If you already own Ghost of Tsushima and Pit, right? Right? Psychopath, if you're watching, I, I, get, I get it for free. Yeah? Okay. If you already own Ghost of Tsushima on PS4, you'll be able to transfer your save to PS5 to pick up where you left off. For new players, the new Iki Island content will be available beginning in Act 2 of Ghost of Tsushima. Oh, wow. They already tell you. Uh, in Act 2, Iki will be available. After you made your way to the Toyotama region. Got it? Jin explores the beautiful Iki Island. Other updates. Uh, alongside the director's cut, anyone who already owns Ghost of Tsushima will be able to download a patch containing some new updates. Once again, many of these updates are directly thanks to the constant stream of feedback you've been... <laughs> positive, positive feedback you've been providing us since launch, which we are uh, extremely appreciative of. All players will receive a patch with some new accessibility options for alternate control areas. <laughs> As well as the option to enable target lock on during combat. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. And for the person who tweets us at us all the time asking for an option to hide your qui quiver during gameplay, 
Yes, we'll be adding that too. Uh, option to hide your quiver during... Oh, like quiver? Like on the back? Like that's a thing that people are passionate about, I guess? Okay. Yeah, the Iki Island seems uh, at least one... In the video, it was very colorful. Um, so, yeah. Finally, for Ghost of Tsushima Legends fans, I am. And we'll also be releasing some new updates, including an all-new mode that we're excited to detail in the weeks to come. All Ghost of Tsushima Legends updates will be able to additional charge, additional charge to owners of any version of Ghost of Tsushima on either platform. So, you don't have to buy a completely new game, just an additional charge. So, I'm guessing it's... Oh, wait. Maybe they'll get... Yeah, okay. Ghost of Tsushima Director's Cut will be August 20th, $70 USD, PS5 is $60, uh, what? Okay, $6 on PS4, got it. <clears throat> You'll be able to pre-order digitally at place, blah, 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 blah. Wait, does it say, I'm sure, I'm sure you all know more about this than I do now. Um, a physical version of the pre-order, you receive the digital mini soundtrack with tracks, like, okay, extra stuff, 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 stuff. Oh, okay, here it is. If you already own Ghost of Tsushima on PS4, you can pre-order and upgrade to Director's Cut on PS4 for $20. This upgrade will uh, become available starting on August 20th. Starting on August 20th, if you bought Director's Cut PS4, you'll be able to upgrade to Director's Cut PS5 at any time for $10. You can also upgrade directly from original Ghost of Tsushima PS4 to Director's Cut on PS5 for $30. So if I had to pay for it, which I don't, uh, it would be $30, I guess? I guess. Additional details about upgrades will be blah, 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 blah. Thank you again to everyone for making this such a special year. We can't wait to share more about Iki, Iki Island with you soon. We. I'm gonna. Can I? I'm gonna. I'm gonna look for. Um. I'm gonna look for. Uh, what's the monkey cut. How to get monkey? No, pet the monkey. Can I see the pet? Pet the monkey. Where is it? I was promised. Oh, maybe it's not here yet. Anyway. Yeah, I thought I saw that in the. It's in the Discord, so I thought I'd look for it, but I'll look for it later. Okay. Uh, what uh, what do you what do y'all think? Uh, I guess you've been chatting away <laughs> while I was reading. Uh, sorry, I couldn't read everything. Um, you have screenshots on Discord. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, cool. It's one minute in. Oh, let's watch it again. <laughs> let's let's watch it again, guys. Can we watch it again? Can we watch it again? I'm just gonna watch it one more time. Is that okay? Is that okay? Maybe yeah, we'll go. S we'll be playing you play. this game sometime. You must first control today. Your emotions. Yeah, no. No, Lord Shimura, I cannot contain myself. I'm really curious about legends as well. Right out. Oh, ow! Am I petting it or is, am I just feeding it? Now! Monkey! Am I being 
weird. I'm being weird. <laughs> look at the little, look at the little butt, monkey butt. Look at the little butt. <laughs> yes, it is Randall. And Randall, you're in the game. Randall. Look at it. It's beautiful. That's it. Forcey, oh, he's forcey attacks. Yes. Anyway. Anyway. Okay. Oh, and that. I want this. I want the. I want the physical copy too, though. Got, nope. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> Sorry. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Have I talked enough? It's been 40 minutes. I've talked talked enough.